Tulips, with their vibrant colors and elegant shape, are more than just beautiful flowers. They're symbolic of love, fame, and perfect lovers in modern culture. Yet their history takes us back to a captivating story of financial frenzy in the 17th century Netherlands. A time when the allure of these flowers sparked an economic whirlwind. This was the era of tulip mania, when the value of a single tulip bulb could skyrocket to heights unimaginable today. But did you know, there was a time when these flowers were worth more than gold? Our story begins in the Dutch Golden Age, a time of prosperity and growth. The 17th century was a period of remarkable economic and cultural expansion in the Netherlands. Trade flourished, art thrived, and society was in a state of constant evolution. Amid this backdrop of abundance, the humble tulip found its way into the hearts and gardens of the wealthy Dutch elite. Initially a novelty, these vibrant flowers soon became a symbol of status and affluence. Tulip cultivation rose to prominence with enthusiasts competing to possess the most exotic and rarest varieties. The bulbs were meticulously cared for and gardens bloomed with a riot of colors each spring. The fascination with these beautiful flowers was so intense that they were often used as a form of currency. As the demand for tulips grew, so did their price, setting the stage for an unprecedented market frenzy. The fascination with tulips soon turned into a wild obsession. As the demand for tulips grew, so did their prices. This wasn't just about the love of a beautiful flower anymore. It was about status, exclusivity, and the intoxicating allure of quick wealth. Tulip bulbs, previously seen as a simple and beautiful product of nature, were now the center of a financial frenzy. This was the era of tulip fever. The Dutch couldn't get enough of these exotic flowers. A single bulb could fetch a price higher than a grand house on the Amsterdam canals. Stories circulated of a sailor mistaking a tulip bulb for an onion, eating it, and inadvertently consuming a small fortune. The bulbs were being bought and sold sight unseen, based on a piece of paper. It was a futures market, the first of its kind, and it was spiraling out of control. Anecdotes of extravagance were commonplace. Men and women, artisans and aristocrats, all were caught in the tulip whirlwind. They traded their land, their savings, their jewelry, everything they owned, just for a chance to strike it rich in the tulip market. But with every high comes a fall. The higher the tulip prices soared, the more unsustainable the market became. Speculators started to sell, leading to a domino effect of falling prices. Soon the bubble was about to burst. In 1637, the tulip market collapsed. What was once a flourishing trade suddenly crumbled like a house of cards. The high prices of tulip bulbs plummeted, and the once coveted symbols of wealth were now a stark reminder of economic folly. The bubble had burst, leaving a trail of financial ruin in its wake. Many investors found themselves bankrupt. Their dreams of tulip wealth turned into nightmares of debt. The fallout reverberated through the Dutch economy. The repercussions felt far and wide. The tulip frenzy had come to a devastating end. The fallout of the tulip mania was far-reaching. With the abrupt crash of the tulip market, the Dutch economy was left reeling. The once flourishing trade industry saw a significant decline as the sudden devaluation of tulip bulbs left many investors bankrupt. This financial disaster had a profound social impact as well. The Dutch society, which had been swept up in the tulip frenzy, was now faced with the stark reality of the economic bubble they had created. The fallout from tulip mania was a harsh lesson in the dangers of speculative trading. It was a powerful reminder that unchecked speculation and irrational exuberance can lead to economic instability. But it also served as a stark warning about the perils of investing in assets with inflated values. Tulip mania was a defining moment in financial history. A moment that highlighted the fragility and unpredictability of economic markets. And so, tulip mania left an indelible mark on the Dutch economy. Today, tulip mania serves as a cautionary tale. It's a vivid symbol of economic bubbles and irrational exuberance that has echoed through the centuries. This 17th century frenzy has found its way into literature, art, and popular culture, serving as a potent metaphor for the dangerous allure of quick riches. From Charles Mackay's extraordinary popular delusions to modern-day financial analyses, tulip mania continues to captivate and caution us. It stands as a stark reminder of the perils of speculation and the fleeting nature of wealth.